did, absolutely did. Um, and this will be planted for the fall too. We had peas in here and um, lettuces. Um, yeah, we've got some Swiss Oh, and this is stevia. Have you ever tried stevia? I have not It tried. is a very sweet, it's a, it's a sugar substitute. Yeah, but that's, I've seen the packets. The, okay, yeah. this is where they come from. Have you guys mm -hmm. tried? I, you know what, I don't it. even remember if I have or not. So. It wow. is extremely sweet. So I use this and dry it's it and we make sugar. tea. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You need some sure. too. One, <laughs> of, Very one sweet. of our other um, honor personalities, Erica, just did a diet in stevia. It was, it was a big yeah. thing. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so I'll use it in tea. Like if I make gather Very, tea, um, like peppermint sugar. for tea, I'll take a few sprigs of this and, and put it right in the the water with it. Um, we've got some tomatoes coming in here, the basil's going to seed. So yeah, we're right at a time where um, it's time to transition yeah. to planting the fall yeah. lettuce and things. Oh, and these are cute. These are little Tom Thumb peppers. Now these look like, do these look hot or sweet? They look hot. They look yeah. hot, Yeah. but they are sweet. Oh, no, you have to trust her. There's a trust factor right here. She, she may be messing she, with you. She has no first. taste buds. So no. We have backup stevia if it's a little too much for you. These are so good. Mm, boy, that is good. They're the one of the little heirloom guys. Wow. Um, what I really like to do with these is um, we'll cut the tops off and then I make a, um, a soft cheese using our our Jersey milk and I'll put mixed herbs in it and you stuff it in oh, and it makes this super elegant oh, wow. appetizer yeah. thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, Karen yeah. does weddings and with her fresh flowers mm -hmm. and her bouquets and it's yeah, all, it was in the garden in the morning and it's on the table and in your stomach by dinner wow. time. That's, that's so on my, while I'm getting source. ready to come here this morning, a florist calls, I need 18 dahlias. Do you have them? I'm like, Yes, let me go pick them. Wait to, yeah. <laughs> and you know, a certain color. Right. So I ran to go pick the dahlias and he'll be coming after I get home. That's something that's kind of an interesting twist. It's Karen's given classes before and she's making, and she's actually had Amish people come to the class. Well, that's my biggest, yeah. yeah there's some Amish kind of, ladies to make cheese, to make sauerkraut. There's some generational shift. So yeah, it, is happened, say, something sounds it has happened with all of society, yeah. including the Amish, that mm. we've moved away from the traditional things. We've gone to convenience, packing, and now they're going back and saying, well, we're all saying, hey, our health yeah. is not what it should be. Yeah. Why not? What can we do to get it back? Right. Um, so yeah. Cool. And, and the Amish, I would say, are heavily interested in getting back because they pay their own in doctor bills. Sure. And they, they so. don't like traditional medicine. They don't tend right. to, yeah. to do True. traditional so, medicine. Uh, yeah. And oh, so here, the Gherkin, and that this plant's Oh, oh, he's, on, he's on his way down. Yeah. But yeah, that's where they, we grew him on a tomato trellis. And we had some kale growing. And these are the little tiny um, current tomatoes. And the worm factory. And worms are so good for your garden. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So it doesn't actually make worms. Well, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't actually produce them. I yeah. used to sell my trellis. Oh, yeah. Around, yeah. And then this is the bean tower that so and we grew the rattlesnake beans on it and we see if there's any again these are kind of at the end of their there's purple ones. I guess it looks like it's dried. Yeah, it's dried up. Okay, yeah, so these are at a point where we could save seeds from them. And these are all heirloom seeds. Yeah, so this is at a point it's dried enough we could save seeds for planting for next year. And that's the seed savers are all heirloom seeds that you can do that. So these were the purple beans and we had rattlesnake beans on the front. And the rattlesnakes are our absolute favorite bean at our house. Um, they're whole bean that are just delicious. So these are seeds ready for drying and saving for next year. Or you can put them into soup. I was gonna say, yeah, just boil them. Down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. on the floor is for sale right. and one of the things that makes us a little bit different is that not only do we sell the stoves for heating and cooking we sell the pieces of parts and the swimming and the paint and we've got service and installation so if you would come in here have not a clue about heating with wood yeah. we could talk to your builder we could get you set up we'd figure out how many stories of home you have how many square feet it is if it's secondary heat or primary heat and then we also have everything for wood chopping wood chopping wood storing and 
and, and some of the stones are more functional. So you can grab. Some of them are absolutely yeah. beautiful. And for ages, soapstone, yeah. yeah. And it retains the heat. Yeah, yeah that's a very... Yeah. yeah. It's like a, when you're talking about a gas fridge, how much gas do you use? Are there two different versions? There are. There, there's here and an LP. An LP, okay. Right. Okay, so um, like an LP, an LP one, if you had a 20 gallon... I know that they do keep food very cold. They're not huge. Some of the larger Am Amish families will uh, often take two and put them side by side. Wow. It's absolutely fascinating. So I told my dad I was going to do this, but then I got into marketing. Right, so sure. And then you don't want I a bunch. Just, you can't have two guys. Yeah, yeah. So sometimes he starts with a photo. Um, sometimes he starts with an image in his head, like this one's interesting because he has the actual photo. Even the chicken. There's the chicken. There's the chicken. It's amazing. Absolutely. So he wanted, he had them um, on display at his home, which wasn't really working out to have people stop by, and mm -hmm. so he would just like them to be displayed, and we said we would be happy yes. to display your artwork. That's him on the film right there. That's